What is up guys, it's DC Kid LV back again with another video. We are playing Under Hero. And on it's it's a game on Game Jolt. Uh it looks pretty well made, but also just looks really interesting to play. Um employee number one. This is gonna be great. I think this is the demo, if I remember correctly. But I don't know, this just yeah, let's do it. Name please. Okay, here is my name. I could probably do ass wipe. That would be good. Okay. Uh, you know what? We're just gonna go with. She kid. How about? Nah, screw it. L. -V. Yeah, I'm good. And yes, I like it. Holy crap, that was loud in my headphones. Please don't do that again. Alright, mode intro, plus world one. The I love e exposition mode, the full experience, the beta recommended. Uh, MB world one only, the I have a lots of things to do today mode, start right on the action. This will, you will miss some story stuff. You know what? I like the story. The story is the main plot of something. I know, no dirt. Book dues mood A. Long ago, there were tales about a distant land known as the Chestnut Kingdom, where generations of princesses were kidnapped by a nameless evil accompanied by an army of underlings. I need to drink a lot there. Ah, that was delicious. Okay. Heroes emerge across the ages to rescue the princesses and save their kingdom from impending doom. Aided by a legendary weapon, the chosen ones battled great evils and were rewarded with magical stones that represented their qualities as a true hero. With immense courage, these legendary heroes defeated the unnamed evil and saved their kingdom every single time. Well, sounds about right. This is but one of those stories. Oh, okay, so we're screwed. Is that what you're telling me? Man, bold strategy, Cotton. Better get that nickel. Better get it. Ooh. Like the music already. Jamming out to it. We're finally here. Looks like this is it, Scarf Boy. Our final battle. Time to save the princesses and the Chestnut Kingdom. Let's go. Okay, so I'm guessing Ace and Jump. What else? So far, nothing. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like up my music camera. Okay, this looks like a pretty interesting game. Let's go. Uh oh. Oh, there's nothing coming at me. Oh, there's gonna be like some Mario crap going on here. Fireball! X. Alright. Doing the other level. There it goes. Listen up. You two. Lord Stitches gave us the honor of protecting this hallway. The hero will have to pass through us before he can reach the boss. So this is our chance to defeat him. You do realize. We're just cannon fire, right? I mean, we don't stand a chance against the monster. We are just here to, like, drop some potions or something. Well, we're not going gonna win with that attitude, Emo Nikki. Sheesh. Hey, you. Yes, you, the quiet one back there. You have anything to say? Mask. <laughs> I don't know, that was some kind of gasp. Please get him out of here. I don't want him in here, just so you know. You what? Listen here, you freak. The plan of here is never, ever gonna work. Why do I always end up with the weirdos? Ugh. What are you doing to him? If you guys haven't seen the last episode, my sister is still here with the freaking cat. Probably doesn't say hi to the cat, but he's cute. Please, please get him out of here. I... 
And I don't want him peeing over anything. Are you sure? Yes. Fine, whatever. Okay, everyone, to your post. You'll be here at any moment. Try to keep up, freak. Um, I don't think I'm a freak. I'm level 99. Holy... Schnockies. That's just... How do I attack? I don't want to stand under here. Yeah. Prepare to meet the best void worm. Wow, that was awful. What does that even mean? You illiterate fool. I was being poetic. We are the masked ones, and we will send him to the void. As in dead. I hope he kills me first, so I don't have to listen to any more of your poetry. Look, whatever, bro. Say, weren't we supposed to be a trio? Oh, no. No! Like I said, I didn't want to be under there. I saw the spikes. It wasn't good. Why did I have to do that? What just happened? Am I evil now? Is someone there? Come here, you. Yes, you. you. Gotta help me. Let me out of here. Or else. I'll just keep annoying you. Thank you. I thought I was done for. Oh no, it's one of you creeps let go of me. Scared by they got me. Help, kid scarf boy. Talk to me, kid. Kid? Can't believe this. He, he's dead. Who did, who did this? Is this the end? Has evil finally won? Someone's coming. Uh, okay, listen. Uh, I'm sorry I called you a creep and uh, can't believe I'm saying this, but uh, I need your help. You cannot tell anyone about me, okay? Dust. Take us somewhere safe. Some place we can talk. Hide me, please. You found a talking hilt. Okay. What's all the rest? <clears throat> oh, Frankie. Hey, what's the rest over here? Ah, eh, screw it. I can't even do an Italian voice. That's just no, no. It's cousin Vinny. I don't know. What's all the ruckus over here? Did the hero arrive? No, 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 nothing at all. I just have a magical hilt. Hey, look, it's messed up Digimon or something. <coughs> hey, what's going on here? Did you... Did you just do what I think you did? Okay, take me to Mr. Stitches, would you please? You're slow, fool. We must continue. Alright, let's give him, like, really stupid voice, okay? We must continue to miss the the words. Look, save your cushions for later. The boss needs to know what you did. Eh, that's just stupid. What if I ask him one more time? You're straight up sabotaging me now. I'm just going to ignore you from now on. Hey. What if I keep doing it? What if I keep doing it? Come on. Snap. Please kill me. Kill me. Nothing. Fine. Nothing. Wait. One more time. Son of a... Okay. Uh... How you doing? Listen here, Fiend. I know I'm pretty, but you better back off. Or I'm going to get aggressive when I get out of here. I'm probably going to be the one saving you, jerk. Sir, I have wonderful... It's a chair. Mr. Stitch. Mr. Sister. Um. Oh. 
Yes. I was playing hide and seek with a princess. Um, I'm right, sir. This minion right here just, just spit it out, you. <clears throat> I, you know, I'm not even gonna probably stick with the voices. This, this minion just killed the hero. I saw it myself. <laughs> Is that so? I have no need for you now. Leave this place and do not come back. Tell me, did anyone else witness this deed? No, sir, I was the only one. I came here as best as I could, my lord. Oh, good. Good. Sir? Oh, crap. Um. Crap hit the fan quick. Why is this a fan? <laughs> now, peculiar. <laughs> Do not worry, Master One. I will not harm you. On the contrary, my dear underling. I have a special task for you. Yes, quite an important mission. You see, I believe you have heard of the Triviality Stones, yes? Oh, you found them in the hero's belongings. Good. Uh, okay. My three top ranking officers are tasked with the protection of these stones. Their mission is to let the hero take the stones when they are defeated. Now that the hero is no more, I need you to take these stones back to their owners across the Chestnut Kingdom. What the heck? Arrgh, frickin' A. This could be quite an adventure. If you could do this for me, you will be rewarded handsomely, of course. <laughs> Here, this stone belongs to the Moth Queen. She resides in the very tall tree in the Moth Forge. After you're done, come back to me to receive the next stone. Do not make, and do make haste, we never know when a new hero might arrive. I'm the new hero, you friggin' Jack! What are you doing? You're just smiling, I'm fine. Oh, before you leave, bear in mind that this is a secret mission. Let's just get stitches, hee hee hee. You know what, I'll probably give him a stoner voice from now on, okay? I wonder, man, what happened to the legendary weapon of the hero? <laughs> I got some Cheetos over here, man. <laughs> she must escape in confusion. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so she was not there, huh? <laughs> Trust you, master one. <laughs> you wouldn't lie to your boss, right? <laughs> See you soon and good luck. I'm gonna finish these Cheetos. You know what? I'll just remember his voice. That was a little close for my taste, then didn't you hear that? Okay, I think you kill they think you killed my hero. Huh. There's no way someone like you could have done that. But enough of that. This is your home, huh? Not too shabby. All things considered pretty crazy cozy, actually. But still, we're not safe here. You must have a place to call your own, right? Take us there so we can talk. I'm here with your items while we travel. You do not. You do know how to check your items, right? <laughs> no friggin' clue, man. I don't even know why. I, I usually go to Best Buy for this crap. Well, at least that's how I got you, right? No? Oh, okay. Smoking too much with the frickin' stitches, lord. Hey, even pushing, whatever. To open your items, you press the back button. There must be a clue there about how to find your place. Oh, speed use. Okay, this is getting a little too loud for me. Uh, okay, well, can't th do the thing. My memory is terrible. Sometimes I even forget where I live. But checking my items menu always refreshes my memory.
sec. Wow, you came... You came from a player. That means you were with the boss just now. Uh, I can turn down my headset really quick. That'll fix the problem. Alright. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, Frank Senor. My daughter Frank was recently promoted, I say, to be the official assistant of Mr. Stitches. As a father, I wouldn't, couldn't be more proud. Don't worry, I'm just nuts. Okay. So where the frick do I go now? Greetings, best child. I have a good tip for you, so listen carefully. Notice that speech bubble above you. That means I can be talked to. If someone doesn't have a speech bubble, oh, I feel like you're doing this deep voice, huh? That means they're busy with other things like patrolling. Very rude if you ask me. Well, yeah, it's too hard for this crap. This way leads to the main castle. I'm under strict orders from Lord Stitches, not at past this point. Wah! Oh, okay. Fine then. Jump down the stairs. This is, this is the, like, even though it took a while to set up some stuff, this is actually not bad. Oh, please, the trickster fox. Hmm. Swiper no swiping? Is that what it's going to be? Up ahead to the left is the cafeteria. You can now have a nice lunch before heading out for patrol. Yeah, I'll probably just head out for patrol. Oh, okay, so um, I have to do this anyways. The hero entered the main castle not long ago. He's probably fighting a horse stitches right now. Um, I actually apparently killed him. Well, took credit for killing him. Do you think the boss would beat him this time? Well, he keeps giving back the frickin' stuff, so he can be beaten. I just came back from the Moth Queen's domain. It's so peaceful there, isn't it? This crap is just really weird. It's like he's allowing them to beat him. This, it's... Best kids are usually tasked with protecting the castle, so you don't have to <laughs> know much about the outside world, right? Ooh, he's purple. I recently got promoted to mini boss. Because of my special coloring and size. Well, I can understand that. If you want to be like me, just hit the gym. Can I eat? I'm not paid enough to talk or something or get out. Oh yeah, I'll take a screw you as a well go screw yourself in a hole. Did you know? Or Stitches wasn't always a beefcake like he is today, apparently. Goes to show that with a good diet and exercise, anybody can become hot. Oh, yes. This is so fucking good. Said help. Well, it looks like he is on, uh, how can I say, heroin? Or something. What do we want? Better salary, better food. Fedoras? Fedoras. Oh, uh, probably look dead sexy in one, but oh well. You're the most transparent union in the kingdom. Smile. In the law of the Lord Stitches we trust, and how we don't, and uh, we right. Okay, um, sweet, I came here for nothing? This was a waste of time. This is not right at all. Um, hold on. Let's go with 1A. The place looks safe enough. I guess it's alright. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's right. I give him like a really weird voice. Greetings, my name is Elizabeth the Fourth. 
and I am a magical man. I have chosen you as my companion to free this world of evil. Do you accept your destiny as the chosen hero of the legend? <laughs> wow, okay. Um, this crap is all sudden. That's it. Um, good enough, I guess. I did give you a short speech. The long ago it was... <laughs> the long one is at least 8,000 words longer. Wow. Uh, I don't want to listen to that one, so can you please not? So what's your name? Uh, are you a girl or a boy? Right. Not important. How about this? I'll just call you kid. Well, hey, DC kid. Already on the roll. Very well, kid. We have no time to lose. If we want to defeat that stitchy guy, he might have he might look goofy, but he is the evil king after all. And of course, we have to fight him. Didn't you see what he did to his own minion? He's obviously going to get rid of you once you finish that mission. Because, oh, well, it looks like I'm screwed and I have to crap. Calm down, we can do this. You have me after all. One thing you must know, though. When I change barriers, I lose all of my power, so we need to train and get strong enough to defeat Mr. Stitches. Here's what I propose. We play along with Stitches' mission so he doesn't suspect a thing. We'll fight with all the bosses and we'll, we will become strong together. Let me defeat him, kid. Fine, and you take all his coins. After all, we're done with him. What? Oh, sweet. How many coins? There's gotta be a way you minions move between worlds, right? I mean, you guys always get there first, somehow. Let's get going, kid, to the forest. Wait. One last thing. If you want to talk about the place we are currently... Oh, our people. Sweet. Try not to bother me so often. But hey, you've got a bed. That's something, right? Right. Okay then. You know what? Screw you. Um, what happens if I go here? This is not your room. Please stop knocking. This is the part of 1D. Uh, okay. Well then, uh, floor two? Is that where we go? What happens if I go here? Why don't we try going somewhere else? Okay. This is more like setting up to the story and then we go on a quest, but how the heck? What is this place? Is this the gym? Tooth lady. Ooh, so down, sweetie. Oh yeah, I got free in your old place, whatever. Looks like you got your employee card. You forgot how to use it. No worries, it's super simple. If you wish to stay clever and start by talking to me, you'll have to pay a small fee, of course. Don't worry, it's only one time. You need to unlock this location. Then it's forever free. Dr. Pang, just head towards that green box over there and then press the X button. And then, presto, your progress has been saved. How about we give it a try? Let me guess, five coins? What? What? New, no, not that I know of. It's probably me. Okay, sweet. So I just need to talk to you. Alright, sweet. Got five coins. Lock this location. Oh, so that heals your health? That coffee offers for life and spirit with just one cup. Just like in real life. <laughs> Fourth wall break. That is, that's just awesome. Best of all, it's completely free. Sweet. See you, Suggas. Did I just... Hey, hey, you, yes, you, come over here. We got some sweet deals for you, if you have the coins, of course. We have selection of potions, upgrade, magic anvils, and more. Uh, right here? I can't see my coins. 
<laughs> oh, I only have five. <laughs> Son of a... Screw it, I'm out. Finally! We're finally into the freaking game! Oh, this looks interesting. Well, look, kid, you see that weird artifact over there? Those were put there by an ancient being to aid the chosen and yours truly in our quest to defeat evil. The same belong. Sorry, the same beings that created me. These eerie statues can record our progress as soon as we pass them. If you fall in battle, we'll start again in, in a statue or a safe station, depending on which one you last save. However, you will always start in your last save station if the game is reloaded. So don't rely on these statues when you want to exit the game. Go to your save stations for that. You got all that scarf boy? I mean, kid. Keep that in mind, kid. Okay then, well it looks like he's missing his pal. Whoa, this is... Up ahead kid, our first enemy. Sweet experience points, baby. You look like a wimp. I'm going to have to teach you how to fight like a real hero. For better or worse, we are a team. Now, so you better pay attention. Now approach that monster. Great. Class is in session, kid. Don't worry, I'll keep it sweet and short. To begin with, you'll find your battle menu with your slick, or you know, whatever, where you can find and do things. Ow, my eyes! That's your sword attack. Fast attack is not even useful. Now, when I say go, use your sword attack with the X button. Ready? That's it. Notice how the green bar over there went down. You attack. That's your stamina meter. Every attack you make requires stamina points, and your sword attacks these three stamina points in order to be used. If you run out of stamina, you won't be able to move until it recharges. Keep that in mind. You can also hold back your attacks if you keep the button pressed down. Good for timing your attacks. Moving on, now that you have your attacks, your enemy, they will gladly return the favor of some pain. If you're an ult, with carefully timing, you can evade your attacks. Freaking bright! Oh my hands! What just appeared your jump button? Oh, sweet! This is your. Okay, sweet, I'll press A. Go! Oh, did you see that kid? Your stamina was replenished when you evaded that attack. <gasps> no, really? That's the most efficient way of recharging your stamina. If you're running low on juice, just evade some attacks. Ah, my friggin' eyes! Next is your crouch icon. We can use it to evade high attacks. This time, I want you to pay close attention to the face of your enemy before they attack. And don't forget to evade the attack by holding down the L stick, Freddy. Uh, I think game froze. You see that? Your enemy pulled out their tongue right before attacking. This is called a hint. Pay close attention from now on to all the different hints enemies shown before an attack. Be aware that you could have more than one attacks too. Learn the movements and react accordingly. Okay, lesson one is over. Time to clear the test. Defeating that monster. Okay then. Okay, I see. You can't move. Bad timing, oh, well, I am sucking. That is such bullcrap. Uh. 
Okay then, that was um interesting. What's this? Oh sweet, I found a potion. I'm guessing that potion. Hold down and press the jump button to stay this to drop down from the platforms. Oh, okay. It's kinda like a run and jump game. Hmm. Well, battle to the death. You need a key for this gate, kid. Come on, it's obviously locked. Yeah. I made that! Oh, double jump. Sweet. Encounter. Time for more training, kids. Okay. Only talk to your enemies. You're all minions after all, but you can only talk before attacking your enemies. <laughs> Learning new info is important, so I have to talk to you before attacking. Now talk to the enemy by pressing rail. That we're having, huh? A little bit chilly though. If the number reaches zero, it's game over, obviously. So to avoid, you know, we're kind of kind of skippish part. Can I hurry up? Oh, sweet, of two potions. That's your potions, but you can use it to replenish 50% of your HP. So use it, just press the notepad. So, uh, your face is messed up, bro. You said what? There you go, feeling better. You can use potions outside of battles too, there are inside your Okay, sweet. Now it's time for your desperate measures. If you don't really like it, we you battle. Well, you could bribe your foes. The only way to stop an enemy from attacking you is with me. To pay coins to your enemy, just press the back button. Let's give it a try. Hey up. Well, if you serve your punch, you better fight with your battles, like I told you. You get way less experience after all. After you pay them enough coins, they will leave you alone and won't be able to fight them again. That's it from now on. Okay, well. Piece. Nice, so I'm guessing there's maybe kind of like a skill tree thing that's going on here. So I'm guessing I'm going to come back to that. You can swim, right? Well, I should be able to. I, I, I got the Olympic medal for the um, Olympic backstroke that you're talking about. I'll take that as I'm not that incompetent, you know? Uh, you could also glide over it, right? It's, it's seen the masked kids glide with their hoodies. Oh, yeah, no duck. Yeah, 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 it's good. Gotta get all those coins, man. Ooh, there's something down there. That's right, found coins. I'm like, there's something under there. I'm probably gonna die, ain't I? I don't know, sweet coins. Sweet, found a potion. Okay, can't get you out of your question. This is kind of interesting. Uh, this is getting... I'll stay up here, not you. 
Go down. Go back up. Oh, great. Okay. So I went through a cave. Guessing there was maybe some enemies over there, but let's go back to. See, look, I freaking knew it. I'm getting every coin in here, and no one can tell me otherwise. Oh, crap. No, do not touch him. He is not sterile. Do not touch him. What are up here? Sweet. More coins. Son of a... You know what? I'm going to leave Maki in here. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed that. And... I'll probably be doing a couple parts of this that I've been recording this for like 3-6 minutes. So, I'm pretty sure you guys probably got have gotten bored by this. But if you guys like it, then I'll play it even more. So, we'll name this as a... Eh. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. As well as, uh, hopefully I keep making more videos. See you guys in the next one. Bye!